my tripod's packed away, so I can't use that. I got my package from Amazon. Yay, it's my little inverter. I needed something to power uh, my laptop and stuff on the trip. Comes with the ones where you connect it to the battery directly, which gives you the full 175 watts. Or you can plug into the cigarette lighter with the other one, and it gives you 130 watts. Let me get it open. It's going to be plugged into the cigarette lighter most of the time. So. Focus. Come on. Anyway. So. 130 watts is enough. 175 watts will actually run an Xbox. A 360. And there's a little fan. I had an inverter. It was a 100 watt one. And it was one of those fat ones that plugged into the cigarette lighter. But. It was really awkward because it would get in the way of the shifter and it, you know, would come out or whatever. So I really wanted this one because it's got a wire. So I can plug this into the cigarette lighter and then this will run down and connect into, connect into there like so. And so yeah, it's just a really big advantage to have one of these compared to the other ones and it was only 30 bucks so it was worth it I'm gonna go plug it in now all right yeah I got this little thing right here it lights up at night it's super duper bright which is kind of cool because um, it plugs into there and then this one right here is my lights I'll turn it on there it's on now and it, at night it's really bright so I can see some of the gauges that normally don't light up but so this one doesn't I w it would be nice if it was like this one and you could just turn it on and off at the button but I like it because it my daughter sits in the middle right here and it shines on her oh, I need to get a new one these things are 10 bucks at Walmart but it's got a little USB port on it and if you go to Walmart you'll notice they got little uh, charging things you plug it into your cigarette lighter it's got a USB on the on the end and it's this one cable and it comes out to two cables so I can charge my transform with this one and I can charge my wife's hero with this one so we can charge both phones at the same time unplug that one plug this one in it's right there now see if it'll turn on Oh, did they send me a... Maybe I need to have the USB plugged into it. Okay, it is on. And I, I love this little thing. It was $5, and like I said, it came with a little cigarette lighter with the USB port on it. And I can charge two phones with this one cable. And you can't use it as a data cable, so it's perfect for a vehicle. Because you, you don't have to run inside and get it to charge your phone. And my phone is charging off of this thing. It was so, that light's so dim, I couldn't tell it was on. I push it, it stops charging. Cool. But you don't have to use this to charge it. I really like this thing. It was $10 at Walmart, and it's got three ports on it. And then it's got a USB port. And I usually just plug the USB port. Into right here. And it charges my phone. Oh, duh. I've unplugged this. Yep, charging my phone, and it's not using this thing. All right, so now I got it. I got the inverter plugged into the three-way, and you can tell that it is coming on. It's it's just it's absolutely quiet. There's not a sound coming from it. 
That's awesome. I definitely, definitely recommend this thing. Now I need to plug something into it that actually draws power. So I got this little thing. It's a 15 minute charger for batteries. And it's I bought it because it's 15 minutes and I'm on trips. I can use this thing. I plug it in a cigarette lighter and then you plug this into the charger and then you can charge batteries in 15 minutes not using an inverter. But I'm going to hook this up to the inverter. I love how small this thing is. It's awesome. Like it's way better than one of those Black & Decker or those new type of inverters at Walmart. Now I'm going to see if the fan will turn on. The fan on this charger is very loud so it might be louder. than. Okay. So I actually have to hit this button. There it goes. You can hear that fan fan very well. This one's not making any noise at all. And it's using a 15 minute charger. There's not a sound coming from it. I'm almost certain you have to use a certain amount of watts before it actually turns on. You can clearly hear this fan. I love this little thing. 15 minutes ain't long at all to charge some batteries. But yeah. Pocket inverter. They make a 100 watt one, but why in the world would you not spend five extra dollars and get one that's 75 watts more? I mean, like I said, this would run one of the new Xbox, even the older Xboxes like the Jasper and stuff. No, I don't know. That's, that's maxing it out at 175, but like the newer ones only use like 150, 145. So you could in theory run an Xbox on a trip. You would need another one to power a TV though. Like I know our little 22 inch LED TV uh, for my daughter, it only uses like 50 watts. I could buy another one of these and run her TV and charge my laptop at the same time off of another one of these while this one powers an Xbox. So I know I'm going on and on and on. I'm just, this is awesome. 30 bucks. Buy one now and then later on when you have another $30, buy it again. This video is over. Thank you. Bye.